hello family and welcome once again god bless you all in jesus Christ's name if this is your first time welcome my name is Shantali Kabe, always coming to you with the word of the lord the prophetic and also we do our prophetic prayers here um if this is your first time please feel free to join the family you are welcome welcome to this wonderful family god bless you in jesus Christ's name amen um there's a word that i want to share with you today and this has to do with you being chosen it has to do with the lord choosing you it has to do with the chosen ones and i know you are listening to this word right now because you are one of those that god has chosen it may be in your family wherever it is but the lord has chosen you and there is a mark upon your life chosen means the lord has actually picked you out he's selected you he's anointed you he's called you he's graced you maybe for a particular assignment purpose whatever the case may be the lord has chosen you He's chosen you to be a leader. He's chosen you to be that person that is going to help bring light where there is no light. He's chosen you to break patterns, break records. God has chosen you. Hallelujah. There are people in the Bible that got chosen by God. We, we know of Esther. Um, this is someone very common. Esther was chosen by the Lord and she was equally favored. There is Joseph. Joseph was chosen by God. And when God chooses you, you begin to see difference. Like things that happen in the life of others they don't happen in your life there is always a difference in your life with the way that things happen with the way that people relate with you with the way that god uses you there is always a difference hallelujah and so when you begin to notice a difference in your life you should know that god has chosen you and that there is something about you that is special that is unique that is not like every or um, common with every other person now why am i saying this God wants you to know this. He wants you to know that you are chosen. He wants you to know that he said I'm ready to use you. He wants you to know that there is an anointing, a call upon your life and destiny. But then you must keep doing what he has called you to do. You must keep, you know, walking with the Lord. Hallelujah. God has chosen, before I came here to release this word, the Lord told me, I have chosen many to bring light, especially where there is darkness in families. I have chosen many to bring light as a lady you'll be watching this message you'll be listening to me you are that person in your family that god has raised to bring people out of darkness out of evil people have been practicing evil in your family they never knew about god they did things their own way but the lord raised you up in that family he anointed you he chose you and he raised you to begin to bring light and by light i mean the word of God. By light, I mean you introducing Jesus into that family. By light, I mean you helping them to come to understand who God is. Hallelujah. And bringing people to the kingdom of God in your family. You are listening to this word and the Lord raised you in that family to bring light where there is darkness. God wants you to keep doing the work that he has called you to do. God wants you to keep doing the assignment that he has called you to do. Hallelujah. It doesn't matter what is going on and when you are chosen always know this they will come after you they will try to fight you they will try to stop you why because the enemy doesn't want you to succeed in that area in that assignment in that purpose they will go against you but the lord is saying i am with you if a thousand is against you and you have one that is a enough one that is mighty and powerful you have god you have ev i mean that is having everything that is having everything and so you have god with you always remind yourself of the fact that you have god with you and no matter what happens no matter what goes on around you god is always with you and he will always guide you now there's something about the ones that god chooses right when he chooses you he's always going to put a special edge of protection around you there is always a special protection when god releases you into an assignment you are not going alone you have a special backup from god in the realm of the spirit there is a special backup that you have from heaven hallelujah and so when you're doing what you're doing and the enemy comes after you there is a special protection from the lord god almighty in your life if you notice in the life of david there were attacks there were attacks from the enemy but not a single time except the lord permitted except the lord 
permitted and when he permits it is for a purpose it's for a reason there was not a single time that the enemy took his life except the lord permitted like Oh, it, or, or except it got to a time where God knew, oh, your time is up. This is the time. It's time for you to come back home and all of that. So please don't let anything discourage you, not even the battles. If God does not permit it, nothing is going to happen to you. No evil is going to come near your dwelling. But this is one thing that God also wants you to know. As you begin to serve him as a called person, as a chosen, God wants you to do it with caution and God wants you to do it with him don't do it with your human abilities your reasoning don't do it with your you know intelligence do it as the spirit leads go with God hallelujah be very careful be very conscious and ask God for wisdom so that you can do the right things at the right time and you're able to also apply everything that the Lord has taught you properly that is wisdom the right application of knowledge hallelujah family so God is saying to you you, you are chosen you are called you are special and you have to do what um you know he has called you to do be strong embrace it no matter what happens always remember that god is with you i wish you nothing but the birds the message behind this word is you are chosen you are the one you are the one you are the one for it you are the one god has chosen you are the one that god is looking up to hallelujah god bless you family thank you if you are new go on and subscribe don't forget to like the video and share with a friend or a family i believe it's definitely going to bless them i love you so much stay encouraged in the faith know that you are different thank you god bless you and i hope to see you shortly